In this video, I'll share the five worst pieces of wedding advice handed out to couples. It's hard to know who's giving out good info, so I'm gonna share the things that really are complete garbage. Hopefully this will help you avoid some headache and heartache as you plan. The number one piece of terrible wedding advice is to always ask for a discount. Sorry y'all, this is just rotten advice. If you are hiring a wedding vendor and the first impression they get from you is that you don't value their service at the price they have set, you put yourself in a bad position. Experienced vendors will shy away from requests that ask for discounts right off the bat. Instead, show your vendors that you do value their service and they'll be motivated to go above and beyond for you. The second piece of bad advice is to combine parent dances because your guests are gonna be bored watching. Nope, that's not true. Now, if you wanna combine them because of some personal reason or omit them entirely because of strained relationships or limited mobility or any reason, that is 100% fine and your call. But don't eliminate or omit these on the grounds of guest boredom. That's just not true. The third thing is this. It's your wedding, don't worry about what everybody else thinks. I wish that were good advice because it would make things so simple. But the truth is that the wedding is bringing together two people, two groups of friends, two families. And if you ignore the needs of the people attending, you position yourself for a lot of drama and discomfort on wedding day. Instead, hear people out, invite them into the process, but stand firm on the things that are most important to you. And that's not gonna be all the things. The fourth worst piece of wedding advice, keep the ceremony short and sweet so you can get to the party. That's not great advice. If you don't care for the ceremony, then fine, go with this, no problem. But your guests will enjoy a thoughtful ceremony that helps them to get to know you and your fiance as a couple. And it's an honor to witness two people in love and deciding to commit their lives to each other. If they're coming to your wedding, they want to see it. And the final terrible piece of wedding advice is this. Don't think about what could go wrong. Everything is gonna be fine. I wish that were true too, but a better option is to carefully come up with plans for various problems and know in advance how you're gonna handle those. Like rain, a missing ring, busted bridesmaid's dress, a late efficient, a miscolored bouquet. You know, you can hire a wedding planner or coordinator if this overwhelms you. They're gonna be accustomed to handling the most common wedding day mishaps and a well-planned day is gonna reduce your overall anxiety and safeguard the investment that you're making in your wedding. I hope my advice on this terrible advice is helpful to you. Thank you so much for watching and happy wedding planning.